Hey guys, this is Spark Plus Ultra here, and this is my part 7 on what if Deku had Blaze the Cat powers, Burning Symbol. And I hope you like this video. Zumi has got back from her hero agency inter search where she got back from working with her job. More like her preferred security guards, I guess? Zumi didn't have that much choice on it. Plus, her dad literally freaked out. So, yeah. Zumi sighs and says, <sighs> Why do I have to keep my dad from not worrying about me sometimes? Then, getting back to school, she sees all of the Class 1A all happy and seeing Silver with how he turned to. And she greets him. Good morning, Silver. And Silver says, Oh, good morning, Blaze. <laughs> and Sun says, Uh, why are you saying like you're on me? And Silver says, Oh, sorry about that. I'm just so excited that I got that went to that hero agency. And Sumi says, huh, oh, what agency? And Silver says, the Freedom Fighters! And Sumi says, Freedom Fighters? Hmm, I think I heard them before. And Silver says, <laughs> they're the team that forms for protection and to help others. They have Sonic the Hedgehog, Tails, and Knuckles in me and surprisingly a lot. They treat me as like they were my family. <laughs> I'm glad to hear that, Silver. But how did yours go? And Zui says, <sighs> sighing with the most look of all faces. She was saying, let's just say it was a good time to have family part of the job. Huh? What does that mean? And Sumi says, Oh, nothing. I just worked at my family's job. And Silver says, Your family has a job? I thought the Queen, Empress, and Emperor of Japan then. <sighs> yes, I meant like my security guards. I was keeping my father's um, very, very frustratingly annoying persistence to protect me. So I went to the only place that could keep his eyes off of me for a second. How? Oh, how was that? And Sumi says, hmm, it was fine. Luckily they didn't give me paperwork. And Silver then says, that's good. And when he says that, two of the boys of Kirishima and Sarah laughing at something and Silver says, Hey guys, why are you laughing at? And Kirishima points, <laughs> Bakugo's hair is hilarious. Huh? You'll see why. Sarah points and Bakugo says, Stop laughing! And explodes and his hair gone back to normal and Silver says, <laughs> Sorry, sorry, I can't help it. That's, that's rich. Shut it, marijuana hair. Marijuana? Where did that even come from? And Kirishima says, You do look like you have marijuana hair. <laughs> huh? I thought it was a, a maple syrup from those maple leaves. Well, it doesn't work that well. No. And so we're good. Annoyed, but not in the way you get annoyed. More like the funny annoyed. And Sumi smiles and says, Well, you're getting so much better with these interactions. And Silver says, <laughs> What can I say? It's no use. And Sumi says, Did you just meet that catchphrase on your own? And Silver says, hmm, it was a once 
with the Freedom Fighters, and they kinda stick. And Silver says, by the way, look behind you. And Sumi says, ah, where did you get the pickle? <laughs> and Sumi says, oh, can't believe you. And Silver says, ah, don't worry, Blaze. I still love you. And Sumi blushes for a second. <sighs> Thank you. Maybe you shouldn't say that. Why? And then Zumi and all of Class 1A go to a training and they're going to find All Might. And All Might explains to them that they must find him. And it's basically who gets to him first in a maze. And she is facing Sarah, Tailan, Mina, and are you ready? You four. And Zumi gets ready and they go off. And all the class bet on some betting on Sarah, some betting on Zumi. But when Zumi takes off, Zumi grabs the pole. Using her gymnastic still skills, she goes up and spins a third degree and lands on a uh, rail and accelerates with her pyrokinesis and Silver says wow she's really she always gets my vote and Mina if Mina wasn't there she would really call him out on that not for that but for obvious reasons she he has her favorite and when he said that Mina says geez these you really have a obvious favorite. And Silver says, What are you talking about? No, no! Silver waving his hands, saying, No, no, it's not like that. And blushing with his face. And all the students say, Right. And Zui makes it to Alma with seconds to spare. And then Silver says, All right, Blaze. And Sumi says, ah, maybe that's a nickname, I guess, for now. <laughs> Sorry, it's so catchy with you. <laughs> then they get the piss, and Sumi takes second place, but nearly taking first from Momo. Silver, and geeky, clumsy, I would say somewhere to, um, 15? It's really even the odds with him. Then Sumi gets to Ah uh, Silver asks if he can if Blaze can teach him about these problems. And Zumi agrees. Taking him to her house, Silver says, Wow! This is really your house? <laughs> well it's not surprising, but And Zumi says <sighs> Well, I did I am the Empress's daughter. With not really intrigued. Once they nearly made me get married to Eggman Nega. Huh? Who the heck is that? <sighs> Just a nuisance. Then Zumi gets Silver inside. And when he gets inside, he gets properly greeted by his, her father. And Zumi says, Ah, Dad, I forgot to mention that this is my friend Silver. And Silver says, <laughs> Nice to meet you, Mr. Midoriya. And the father says, Hmm, so this is the Silver I've been hearing about? And Silver says, Uh, is there a problem? Hmm, yes. And as comedic things go, the Zumi's father asks for questions and wants to protect Zumi. As obvious, comedic gag to go. Silver getting overwhelmed by that. And Zumi says, Dad, leave him alone and go. And getting broken by his own daughter, Zumi goes to take him to her room and to teach him. And Silver says, Wow, I didn't expect your 
dad to be so protective. <sighs> yeah, it's a problem, but I still care about him. Just, he's too old for bearing, just like my mom. And Silver says, <laughs> is this the first time I ever been to your house or your room? And Zumi says, hmm, yeah, it's, <laughs> and when he said that, Zumi face reds up real quick, and Silver then says, oh, then reds up as well. Oh yeah, what was that about? You love me back in the tournament? <sighs> I accidentally got in the moment. I'm sorry. Yeah, it's okay. Both Zumi and Silver get a s unsettled but trying to keep calm with their feelings. And Silver passed with real quick ease thanks to Zumi's guiding and Zumi and Silver passed the written exam. But now they're going to do the hero exam where they team up the students in their class. Silver is partnering up with Ia and Zumi, well obviously, Bakugo. Because these two did not have really trust each other. Silver and Ida were against Power Loader, and Ida was conflicted and trying to get through what happened dealing with Stain. And Silver says, Are you okay, Ida? I know what happened to your brother and what Blaze helped you, but you need to get through it. Your brother is still alive. It's better than nothing. And sure, he doesn't have his powers thanks to Stain destroying his legs. But I know you can heal. Keep on fighting. It doesn't matter if his quirk is useless now. He'll be the best, still the best brother you will have. And Ida says, Thank you, Silver. I do admit that I had the most problems. I cannot deny that. Heck, Blaze saved me through my arrogant action. I can't even deny it. And Silver says, <laughs> Well, not much on motivations, but thanks. I got lots of pep talk with Sonic thanks to him. I got Really good with it. And Ida says, hmm, remind me to say sorry to Blaze. And Silver says, no problem. <laughs> now, let's get to work and deal with Power Loader. Hmm, I can't see him. And Ida says, well, I can't run on this. This is going to be difficult. Hmm, I think I got an idea. Huh? What is it? Then Silver says, Psychokinesis! Duh! I can lift both of us to the- to get to the gate. And Power Loader says, Not so fast! And attacks from the air. Gah! And Ida says, Not so fast! Recipro burst! Hitting Power Loader's arm. And Silver says, Thanks, Ida! And then Silver got the idea. Ida, get ready for the next attack. And Power Loader gets ready. Ida says, are you sure? Trust me. I'm going to myself. Keep you in. What? You'll figure it out soon. And Silver lowers himself down. And Power Loader says, bad move, Silver. Oh, you think I'm going to let that stop me? You got another thing coming. And Tenya says, <laughs> Got you, villain! And Power Loader says, What the? And Silver says, I'm lied a bit on the Lord me down part. I can't push him that far, but I can lower down myself. And 
lower down him as fast and catch you up. Surprise, destroying your arm. And then Paralor says, God, get underground. But Silver says, not so fast. And stopping him with psychokinesis. And Silver says, Ida, now, get the locks. And locking the Paralor, the Silver and Ida wins. And in the camera, Sumi was relieved that both of them won. And the next is going to be her and Bakugo. And, and Su Sumi sighs and says, Great, now I gotta deal with the raging explosive temper guy. Don't worry, Sumi. It's going to be alright if he can cooperate. And Sumi looks at her. Yeah, we'll see. And Sumi goes to him facing off with All Might. <sighs> Can't believe I'm partnering up with you. And Bakugo says, <laughs> Bring it on, she cat. I'm not going to listen to you. And Sumi takes a brief, deep breath. <sighs> Maybe we should work on our team. Alright. And Bakugo says, <laughs> Yeah, right. Why would I? team up with you. And Sumi says, ah, it's just why I have distrust in you. <laughs> and I don't like you either. So there. And Bakugo and Sumi were arguing on, on what they need to do. We need to get away from All Might because we need to find a way to get around him. Not defeating him. I can't I may be fast, but I'm not dumb on how he fight. We're dealing with a veteran. And Bakugo being stubborn, saying, Shut up, you she-cat. Huh? Why don't you listen to me? Bakugo says, <laughs> Why would I even listen to a princess that doesn't even want to acknowledge that I'm better than you? Huh? I ain't acknowledging you because you're so arrogant. And both looking at each other with tense of anger. One side needs to find a way to beat him in all my in a way. But the other will take on. But when they stopped from paying attention to the person they are looking at, All Might says, All right, here I come, heroes! And the Using a punch, creating a storm of a dust sides of buildings. And both keeping a blocking that and see All Might appear right in front of it. How did he, huh? And I don't care if this sea is destroyed. He's so intimidating. And All Might goes for a punch for Zumi and Sumi dodges with reflexes, narrowly dodging the punch. What the? Is he that fast? Even with my with no reaction, I can't even... I nearly dodge the punches. And Bakugo says, Get out of the way! And explodes. But All Might says, Huh, no, you will see how a villain is. All Might is overwhelming. Bakugo and Zumi and Zumi spins herself to keep a distance but All Might says hmm a fire spin does not work if it's dissipated air can dissipate making Zumi out up in the air Wah! and Bakugo was going to attack him from behind but All Might grabs him and throws Bakugo to Izumi, and Bakugo says, Whoa! And Izumi looks, stops her rotation, but with her heat hovering for a second, and Bakugo crashes into her from being thrown by All Might, Gah! and hitting the ground hard. Uh, why did you think to go behind him? Shut up! And Izumi says, uh, I need to we need to get out. And Sumi sees some 
ideas. Hmm. Okay. Pyronado. Flames of fire swirls up with no end of heat. And oh my sets. Huh. This again. I thought I told you that this isn't fire can be easily extinguished. And using his Texas smash to anticipate the fire. But All Might looks around. Huh? That wasn't even a attack. It was more of a distraction. Clever. And feeling the cuffs, he thinks, Damn, these things are heavy. And Zumi and Bakugo go in the hide. And Zumi says, I told you that it was a bad idea. Even if I was prepared for him. Which you haven't even known that he could hit harder than a freaking nuke. <sighs> Why don't you give me a break? I gotten close, then you can. You're right. I can keep pace with him in speed, but I wasn't even expecting him to use any of us his disagreements. <sighs> can we agree, Bakugo? I'm not arguing with this. I want to win, but if we keep butting heads, then it's going to have problems for us. And Bakugo sighs and says, <sighs> Fine, what do you have up your s- If I don't like it, then we're brute force. And Sumi explains their plan. Sumi heats up Bakugo's sweat and tries not to explode it, and all like looking for both Bakugo and Zoom. And Bakugo using his gauntlet to explode in the face, but all like saw and dodged. But when Zui comes behind him, she doesn't have his gauntlet, and all like says, huh? Why doesn't she have the other gauntlet? Then Zui says, <laughs> Surprise! And the kicking some fire at All Might. And All Might defo- bouncing using the air to repel them. But when he repelled one up, there was Bakugo's gauntlet right coming down on him. And All Might says, Huh? How? And Zumi says, I use a little trick. My, my speed allows me to even my fire can allow me to accelerate the spin off of my throws and kicks, meaning I can throw it up in the air for a bit. You fall for my plan. You were expecting us to use each other both gauntlets, but I, mean Bakugo, had a clever trick to surprise you. You fall for the bait, and now it's, it detonates. The gauntlet explodes from Sumi's fire in front, of, in front of All Might's face. And Sumi's, let's go! Right behind Shady Cat! And says, I'll buy us some time. And All Might Bakugo says, This sucks! Why are we always going to. Why did you have to destroy my gauntlet? And Sumi says, We need. Buy us some time. I can get to the end. Bakugo said, Hmm, now we could have used my grenades. Those won't last long. We needed something to hit him with explosion. And Bakugo says, Huh, well, what do you know? You are a pyrotechnic. And Sumi says, Hmm, what can I say? My family's fireworks and I sometimes like them up. And All Might says, that was a great teamwork. I didn't expect that trick to work. And All Might was looking at both of them. Sumi accelerating at a fast speed and Bakugo behind her. Well, now I'm just getting warmed up. Come on, heroes! This isn't nearly a test! And All Might speeds and gets nearly behind them and Sumi says Bakugo can you grab my leg for a second <laughs> right on shitty cat stop calling me 
shitty. Then Bakugo throws, grabs her leg, and Zumi says, ah, now get to it. Zumi uses her fire to accelerate both Bakugo's explosion and her speed and made it to the end on a blaring note. And All Might says, huh, not bad. You used your omens and won with combination. I'll, you have won this battle. And Zumi says, ow. I think it got me on the ribs while you throw Bakugo. Ugh. It was going to seem they say the same damn thing. <sighs> and Silver comes to Zumi's aid and helps him out, her out, and says, Ooh, that's gonna hurt. Well, you made it, that's for sure. <laughs> Can you? Jeez, Silver, you always know to laugh sometimes. And Silver says, <laughs> Well, you have to always look at the brighter side. Brighter side. And I hope you like this video and hope you subscribe. See you next time.